Hey guys and welcome back to my new video. So in this video I'll be teaching you how to make your own marketplace slash store on Second Life. So this will be on the marketplace and I will be making videos how to make your own store in world and how to create for beginners and blah blah blah. Anyways, so I'm using this account that I made one year ago and I never used it and I don't have a store in here. So I'm going to show you how to make it. So first of course log in into your uh, marketplace and we're going to click here and there's uh, this icon create a store and we're going to click on it so it says to create a store you must you have a payment method on file um you use a payment method uh, for a transaction you must agree basically you have to add your own card to this and, uh, and as it says not all conditions are met so i have to go on my billing information and add it in so you have here all the payment methods, so I'm going to go with PayPal. So I added my billing information, so all I'm going to do is agree to the issue here. But if you have Second Life and you have purchased linens before, there should be no issue for you. But since on this account, I never purchased linens. So in order to make a store, you have to purchase linens once. So I'll do it just for $2 just to have it. And okay, so now we can start i hope and there we go so now we are at a merchant home so now let's click here store setup edit store information so then we come on this page and you have to pick a store name and be sure it's not taken by somebody else and so i'm gonna name the store below i hope it's not taken below is my dog's name then profile you can put some stuff in so I'm gonna skip this skip so if you have a blog you put a link if you have a store in world put a link so for the store image it's really important so when somebody clicks on your store then you have a nice banner uh, on my main account I have a picture in here that's what you also can do but I'm gonna just put it in below inside again And you can also add a manager, somebody who's going to manage your store, but you don't need that, to be honest. So let's save. And there we go. We have here the store button here. And now let's click on my store. So this is how the store looks, and it's really gorgeous. It's empty now, but uh, in the next video, I'll show you uh, how to make stuff, how to make shapes. For now, we'll show you how to upload your own gacha. So don't mind my new avatar. What you also should do when you go to your preferences. By the way, use the Firestorm viewer. So when you go on network and files, be sure the web browser is not set on this. It should be on the first one and click OK. Almost every store has a gacha and usually when you go in a store and you buy what you want, but here you kind of gamble and play. Basically pay and get one of these items. There are rare ones and there are some random ones and the prices are pretty cheap. So. I'm going to click here Matria, 75 linens, and I got this one, biker shorts in white, and this is this one, so let's sell it now. So you cannot sell any other items when you buy, but only gachas. You open your recent folder, and here it is. What you're going to do is, so usually you click here and copy and move to marketplace listings, but I will re-log, maybe that's why it won't work. So I'm back and now I have the option so in case you didn't get it so you go here click on marketplace listings and then it should work so you can click here and move or you can uh, like this drag and drop and click OK. So now it's here we click on unlisted now what we're going to do right click create a listing then we are at unlisted right click and click add list and now it's going to be added to the marketplace. So now we are here on the marketplace listing from this item. So you skip this, you skip this. So what you're gonna do is click activate. If it's not activated, it won't be shown in your marketplace. Then maturity level, it's general. Mesh, it is 100% mesh. Permissions, uh, transfer, so all the gadgets are transferable. Then uh, we go here, uh, what it's needed, unpacking. It's for mesh avatars, and here is the name of it, so you don't have to change anything. So then here is the description, so you can say 
uh, no refunds or whatsoever because you cannot, uh, like, nobody can get refunds because it's a gacha. You are not the creator, you're just a reseller. And if by here you do not put uh, anything, but I mostly put one item only. So, keywords, uh, so it's Vilena, it's shorts, biker, white, Maitreya. So everything that like describes that item and then category of course you go in here browse and on the bottom is gacha so you click on that then the price so I paid 75 but you can put any price you want so I'll put 75 again and uh, of course uh, second half is gonna take some fees so you want to get 75 so Keep that in mind. So for image, um, what you can do is, what I personally do, so copy the name of it, open a new marketplace, yes, copy paste, because other people have purchased it as well. So I'll click on the image, but be sure you click on it so it's bigger and then you download it, otherwise it will be too small. So now we have our image, so you scroll down, of course you have no demo, and you again, you click update. And this is how it looks, so you have your first gacha. So let's do one more time to repeat it, so move to marketplace listing. If it's a gacha, you have to move it. Create a listing, okay. And if it doesn't want to work, you have to open it up and activate it. And then you can go edit list. And again, we click activate. We click 100% mesh, transferable, unpacking, mesh avatars. So this is a lipstick. Uh, again, one item only. And here again, I will put this in description. And let's add a keyword: makeup genus. We have this. It's still gacha, no matter what it is, shorts, makeup, it's all gacha. Select this category, put in the price, I'm going to put it uh, 75, everything. And then the image again, I'm going to copy and paste this one. So let's put it in. Of course, everybody else have it as well. Click on it, open it up, save image. insert the image and be sure it's activated and that's it update so you can also click here in my store and you have the options so that way you can sell a gacha especially if you're longer in second life and didn't know how to do it actually good luck with selling and let me know if this was helpful for you so the next video i will be showing how to create on your own using meshes and yeah and then i'll make also a video how to make shapes and like i said i will make a series of these helpful tutorials and don't worry i will also make some remakes and also editing tutorials i'm really excited for this year and i have so much in plan so yeah be sure to like my subscribe and i'll see you in the next video bye you should see me in the crowd